Oh, shit. What the? Hey, how is it going? I hope you all doing well. Uh, running with some coffee? If I look a little bit... Caught a little bit of cold? That's why my voice sounds like this. But this part of the case is... Liza P, the weapon finally got dropped. You get the main weapon. You get a hat. You With an outfit for absolutely free. W devs. Azure Dragon Crescent Glaive. It's a great sword. Weight is 17.9. It's a Motivity C Technic B weapon. It's pretty balanced, right? Cause it's, you know, you, you can crank it to Motivity B. Uh, you can crank it to Technic A. So, uh, damage reduction rate while guarding 58. Not bad. Not bad. But yeah, it reminds me of Sekiro. But here we are for the main thing. The main part. The Holy Grail. Fable Arts. Deflect Counterattack. Storm Slash. I see you, Debs. Also, let's get the song running. Shout out to Invent Animate, freaking. I love this band. If this Break down every day keeps demons away. Use in time with an enemy's attack to deflect and dodge back. Here's the attack landing. There we go. So, normally, if you just use the Fable Art, it's basically a dodge, okay? It's basically a dodge. You can dodge like back. You can dodge side. I mean, I don't know how efficiently you can dodge, but it's it's actually a you know quick dodge. And if you use the normal fable art and dodge, it consumes a fable slot. And I still hate Archbishop from the bottom of my heart. I hate that boss. Archbishop is harder. But here, here's the thing. So now if you time this dodge with the incoming attack, it's basically a perfect parry. And if you successfully do that, it doesn't consume any fable slot. Oh, sh Here's the attack landing. There we go. It doesn't consume any fable slot. Up to this point, it is already broken. It consumes zero stamina, zero fable slot. But then they're like, okay, bro, while dodging, follow up with a normal or a special attack to deal more damage. Just uh, tap the fable and then I'll follow it up by a light attack. <laughs> or you can just show with a heavy. Now, this is the most, I think, fastest stagger you can do for the big enemies. It's basically a stagger attack and it consumes the Fable slot. Like, it's like the two dragon sword. You just parry it and just like, zoop, like the next the stagger attack. It's like that kind of fast, but I think the only difference is it has more range to it than... Uh, Two dragon sword uh, stagger. Now you know what that means. You can basically you can basically spam it. That's the blade fable art. Okay. In case of handle fable art, hold that. Oh, okay. I mean, try this, bitch the most ranged attack you can do i think in the whole game if i'm not wrong like i am standing in the stairs like this far you look at how far that is and and this is actually a stagger attack i can't see shit what the f i mean I don't know. So for the normal movesets, there are three light attack movesets animations and two heavy attack animations and then like running and other stuff. So you just do one, one, two, three. And for the heavy, it's just like bonk, one, two, and then another bonk like that exploding pickaxe kind of thing. One thing here is like you need to learn like when you're gonna spam and when you're not gonna spam because the moment you're just gonna do the second light attack, it goes to this animation. So throughout this animation, you cannot parry. Uh, so here we go. One, and I start the animation and I cannot parry until the animation ends and then you're gonna die. 
Oh, come on. This... I kind of like this combination of light attack, uncharged heavy, and light. Like that. Because... I don't know, I kind of like that spinning. After all this, we have a running animation. Like, if you run and then do this attack, it's a multi-hit. You just run and like, light attack. And then yeah, that's the uh, fall. It follows up by that combo. There is a run and an uncharged heavy. Run and uncharged heavy. It's like, shove it. <laughs> oh my god. Shove it, shove it. I kind of like the. Uh, there are two charged heavy attack animation. One is you just hold it. One is this. Another one is like multi hit like this. I kind of like the first one. Kind of it's kind of like night jar slash kind of. But the second one is also good. Simple words. The charge heavy attack is outrageously slow. And you gotta time it when you... So basically it needs skill. Like, I mean... you. I had really hard times with the King of Puppet Phase 2. Oh, you do... He do... He do Those attacks are such time that you can't just... It's not about being fast. It's about the way, like, the combos... Uh, yes, obviously it has a rhythm to it and if you get the rhythm it will create this beautiful like whole play play through it but basically it makes it secure like you need to know where to just like do the thing because the stagger window will be open everything will be fine but you n will not gonna be able to uh, stagger him one two oh he bullshit you know if you want to look hella cool and just like actually actively using it it needs that secure type of kind of learning come on man he just oh god so i'm um, yeah i'm just gonna say it this way first of all you can just spam this weapon if you know when to spam oh sh come on oh oh whoa, whoa. you can get fast dagger if you know when to do it there we go Ooh, that was crazy. And it looks beautiful. I know, it's like the most dumbass explanation of this weapon or whatever. I just me trying out. If you liked it, I really appreciate that. I'm very insecure of the word subscribe. We're just like as at phase two, the boss is staggered. I'm just legit less than 400 subscriber away and it's free. So if you do that, it will mean no... It will mean world to me because it help it will help me make more videos. Thank you so much for uh, watching, and I will I will I will, I will make more videos about this weapon. Also, the weapon tier, the, the tier list video, and the weapon abomination episodes are coming back. I know I was I felt sick. I was mess you know messing around with some stuff in the life, just doing some shit soon. Uh, but uh, thanks for sticking around. Good night. Good luck. Keep yourself alive. You there. You got this, man. You got this, boss. It's just, it's only a matter of time, and you will beat the boss. Trust me. You, yes, you. I see you there. You can do this, okay? You can do this. I see that badass protagonist inside of you. I will see you uh, in the next video. Oh boy, I'm Alex from Microsoft. <laughs>